Hey, what's going on guys? I apologize for uh, not posting anything to the channel for a few months since maybe November, December, whatever. Uh, but you know what? I'm back. I'm back. Back at it. So today we got a little surprise. My birthday was March 30th. Bought myself a little birthday gift. Couldn't have gone better. I got myself a 1999 323i 5-speed door needs some paint the owner before me decided to bondo the keyhole so you can only use the keyless entry which is a pain if that shit breaks he has a nice MagnaFlow exhaust on here I don't like it, it's not loud enough. Some typical BMW bubble paint. That fresh ass air freshener. Came with drilled and slotted rotors, which are warped. Has these beautiful curb rash rims with pretty decent new tires. Comes with misaligned grill pieces and hood rust. Does not come with halo headlights. Comes with HIDs. And my favorite part is uh, this. Whenever you go down to a track, you know, you want that extra power, you just take this shit off. Never have to worry about your weight or whatever. Do they ask you got a roll cage? Shit, I just put this back on. This way they can't ask me if I need a roll cage. There you go, you just solved the problem. It did come with the coffee cup in here. Just kidding. Has a nice little rumble to it, but you know, I'm not a big fan of it because it's not loud enough. But let's give you guys a better sound of it from the back. Doesn't too sound, doesn't sound too bad from back there, but you know it could be def could definitely be louder. That MagnaFlow wasn't doing too much uh, of what I wanted to do, so maybe we'll do some work to that. This uh, you know this doesn't mean I sold the Nissan. Nissan's still the daily. I drive this probably more often than the Nissan nowadays because I'm getting I'm trying to get used to it and. Uh, first manual car. I did not learn on this. I had past experience driving this, but first car that I owned to myself that was thick. So uh, stay tuned guys. This is going to be my drift car, or at least I'm going to try to make it a drift car because a little is underpowered and a little too heavy, but uh, you know. Nothing stops a hoomobile. Alright, peace out. And thank you for all those subscribers out there. Follow me since day one.